<laughs> Hello, you two. How are you? Good. How are you? Good, thanks. Oh, Louis, uh, did you speak now? I can hear you. No, we can't hear you. Yeah. Can't hear you. I can't, can you also not hear Louis? No. Uh, it's his AirPod. Tammy, <laughs> well, while Louis is getting his sound sorted, welcome. Um, so honored Thank to have you. you here. You are you. undoubtedly a, a heroic woman within Jeff, and I know Louis obviously sees, you know thinks incredibly highly of you. He he's he's spoken to me about you before. So so while we're waiting for Louis to come back, how did you get onto the one on one? How long you've been with Louis for? Um, what's it be like? I know that Louis um, <laughs> is Louis, and um, the man does not beat around the bush. Um, yes. He's hectic, but he's amazing. I mean, he's incredible. Yeah. Um, so so how did your, your time on the one-on-ones come about? Um, so last year when lockdown started, I actually saw like a Jeff workout um, that was they doing with Discovery. And okay. I, was, um, I knew I was getting married in December and I had quite a bit of weight to lose. Hey, Louis. Hello, hello. Um, <laughs> um, and then I saw this workout and I thought, okay, you know, like at least this is a way that I can keep busy. I can do my exercise mm. at home. Um, Cause I mean, we couldn't at that stage, couldn't even like walk around uh, in the park or anything. Crazy, um, and then, eh? so, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I actually can't imagine thinking back of that, that like we managed it, but I mean, I'm very happy for it because it brought me to Jeff. Yeah. Um, and then I started doing the 8 a.m. workouts and I literally like moved my whole work day around. Uh, people at work like even knew I started at seven so that I can do my Jeff workout at eight. Um, yes, then, that's so epic. I love yeah. that. Take control. It's all prioritizing. That's what it is. Yes, man. <laughs> um, and then like I think after two months, like, uh, myself and my mother-in-law, we started seeing these amazing transformation pictures that were being posted by people. And we were like, you know, like we both really needed to lose weight for for my wedding. Um, and we were like, you know, like what's the worst? Now we're like umming and awing, like are they only posting the best pictures? <laughs> Is it one of those situations? And we were like, you know, like we're just going to try one month. I mean, if we don't see any results, then at least we can say, you know, we've tried. Um, and that, that's when I joined. I think I joined the one-on-one -on -one in May last year. Mm. And I think I was on it like for five to seven months, stopped just before my wedding. Um, and like, it was honestly amazing. Like, like literally after the first month, uh, first month, I saw such incredible results um and like it's literally changed my life um i mean wow. now i think it's so important that people also know like it's not a crash course diet like it's actually a lifestyle um yeah. i mean i do the jeff life exercises but i literally eat the jeff way like it's become part of who i am That's incredible i remember your transformation i'm hoping <laughs> you can pop your pictures up i remember it so clearly it <laughs> is insane and uh, can we yeah. just take a second and put it on the screen because you it's 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 redonkulous yeah god uh, hey. amazing that's what it is. i mean like you must just go that is that me like do you just yeah can't, you just can't fathom how 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 well you've done i mean it's unbelievable Incredible. yeah you even it's got absolutely. pluckies on them yeah <laughs> <laughs> amazing oh. louis so why is this woman so flippant inspiring to you? And, and uh, a Jeff heroic, one of our Jeff heroic, I think, Jeff I think, heroes, you know, the, heroes. The thing that stands out for me is, you know, she she arrived having a goal in mind, um, mm -hmm. you know, and it, it's, it's not, she, she knew exactly from day one what she wanted to achieve. You know, she set her mind to it. Um, and like she's mentioned, it's, it's, it's not always the easiest, you know, times throughout her journey, it's been, you know, we've had our moments yeah. where it's been difficult. <laughs> we've had our moments where, you know, there wasn't results. But yeah. I think, you know, Tammy, you know, she trusted what I was doing. She trusted the process and, you know, just trusted in herself, which is more important. And what she is doing um, is mm. working for her. And I think, you know, that for me was very admirable that she, she, you know, she believed in herself and she worked incredibly hard. She didn't give up for a second. 
you know, like she mentioned there, she started work at seven just so that she can do a workout at, um, at eight. So, you know, that for me is, is, is it's planning, it's prioritizing. It's, and, yeah. you know, last night you spoke to one of my clients, Gail, and I think something that stood out for me in that conversation is women often push their, I wouldn't say priorities, but things that they enjoy, things that make yeah. them happy aside to, to be a mother or, or to be the woman figure in the house, um, you know, to support the husband, to support the kids. Um, and yeah. I'm not saying dude, that's the role, but I'm saying that is a common tra you know, trend. And it, it, for me, it, it's so inspiring to see, you know, a woman take charge and really chase what she wants to achieve. And, you know, that's Tammy. She came here day one. She's like, listen, it's my wedding. Eight months yeah. time. I lose weight. I was like, doll, we will lose all the weight. We got this. And we got all this. of it. And, you, you know, we worked hard. We worked hard. It was a struggle in the beginning. She didn't like her veg. Man, no. I had to fight with her. We had to make it interesting. <laughs> we had to make it pretty interesting, but she's done very I well. Love that. And the moment for me that was very special is when she shared her wedding pictures. You know, that's, that's what I was going to say. That was the day. Like, that. that's what we worked for. You know, like getting on the scale. Um, and, and doing these assessments every week or every four weeks is not as impactful as actually seeing what she was chasing. Yeah. You know, we, do we, we have, do we we have that photo? Do we have that picture? Unfortunately, yeah, we don't, yeah. No, that's but, but I remember it so we'll clearly. It I remember amazing. it so clearly. And yeah. we, everyone was just like, wow. Oh, it's just Tammy. Sorry, I'm frozen. No, you're back. You're back. It gets Tammy, the ones, yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Tammy, I want to know, because we often talk about, and I've spoken about in the last two days, around not always focusing on, on the aesthetics. So that's something that I think is really important because we, especially women, you become obsessed with what's happening on the scale and yeah. what, how much steady light we have and all that rubbish. But how did you feel on your wedding day? Because that's, that's the gold, is how you actually felt yeah. within yourself on that day. It actually gives me your... I get emotional. Think, how did you feel on that day, and being no, so it, proud of yourself? Yeah, it was honestly, it was incredible because a year before I joined Jeff, I um, I went to like try on wedding dresses, and I had decided on a dress. Um, okay. And but the reason why I went to this specific shop is that they had a specific dress that I absolutely loved and really, really wanted. But because of my body shape at the time. Like it was impossible for me to fit into the dress, like my dream dress. Mm -hmm. So I ended up deciding on something else um, because of the way I looked and I didn't want to feel uncomfortable or like look at my pictures now and like look, you know, and say, sure, like I just wished I did something about myself. Yeah. Um, and after I joined Jeff, I was able to, I went back to them and I said like, listen, I've changed my mind. I want my dream wedding dress. Like I'm somewhere getting goosebumps. <laughs> no <laughs> way. I didn't. And I literally, and I, I, I felt I took the dress that was my dream wedding dress that I had dreamed about, um, and that I went to the shop for. And like, I mean, I can only say thank you to Jeff. Like, literally, like I don't have to ever look back at my wedding photos now and wish that I had a do over because, you know, I didn't do something about the way I felt about myself um, and how the pictures look. Um, so it was honestly like, I, I just can't say thank you enough uh, because I never have to regret anything about my wedding day. Obviously I don't regret marrying day, but in terms of, <laughs> like, the dress, <laughs> in terms of like the dress and like how I looked and how the photos came out, like I don't look at any of those with like one ounce of regret because I was Amazing. so, so incredibly happy. Oh man. And you, and you, you, and you wouldn't have, you would have, you wouldn't have been critical of yourself because that's also what women do is we look yeah. at something of ourselves and we literally break it down and are just totally yeah. just criticize everything about ourselves. Yes. And that's generally because we're unhappy with what's happening yeah. here and how we see yes. ourselves. So it's just your Tammy, like I remember you just, you radiate and it's, I'm not yeah. just talking about physical beauty, but you just look yeah. so happy. Um, and I'm so happy for you. Um, and Louis, 
Louis is incredible. I mean, the oak yes. does not get around the bush with his clients, <laughs> as we said in the beginning. But that's yeah. how he gets you to where you want to get because he's your coach yeah. and he's got to he's got to push you when he you know on the days that you don't want to be pushed. No, um, I would just say as well, you know, for me it's mm. it's 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 bigger than what she's been through. Like it's it's massive. Yeah. You know, it's mm. you've had a big probably the biggest day of your life. Your life was your wedding yeah. day, but it's not just that. You had the biggest couple of months of your yeah. life, which yeah. has set you up to to you know to be in a better space and to just be more kind towards mm. yourself you know, you've, you've worked for seven eight months to be in that mindset on that day which is which is very very admirable so tell me ah oh, it's super blay up here my darling well done very proud of you and that Thanks. just goes to Amazing. show like all all the women out there or anyone you know yeah. mm. chase chase what you want she had the option to go for another dress and she refused that she wanted that dress mm. um because that made her happy and that's what she wanted and and that's for anything in life. You need to chase what makes you happy. You need to you need yeah. you need to chase what you want and work for that. You can't be happy um, or keep people happy if you're not happy, right? So chase it. Love yeah. that. Absolutely, Tammy. Yeah, I mean, you are so inspiring. Um, like I said, we all we were all so chuffed for you when when Louis spoke about about you all those months ago, and you're still on it. And that's what's amazing. It's sustainable. Yeah. You're still doing yeah. it. You're still yeah. happy. You're still energized. It's all of that that is what's so important. So, so so tough for you. You look you look amazing. Even standing here, I can see that you're happy. Lou is an absolute steam cat. Um, thank yeah. you for joining us. It was so <laughs> so lovely you. to have you guys here. And um, keep keep at it. Don't stop. Thank you. Thank you so much. Good fun, Thank you, guys. Bye. 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 B